Hi, you know, to find the best investors in your syndication deal are your friends, your family, your relatives, your brother, sisters. I, I see that because they know you the best. They know you so that they will be the ones who would love to see what you have, what you have found a gold gem, <laughs> you know, a biggest uh, money making value add property. It could be storage units, could be mobile home park, could be apartments, could be hotel, could be boutique hotel, could be senior assisted living, you name it. But the key thing is that you are able to do that from your, from your circle, right from here, all the way out, all the way out. Now, one thing you definitely want to keep in mind is not to spend too much time. Once you find out that the person you are talking to is not does not have much money to invest or they are still in the process of building their you know savings and so on like that you give them small education and then leave them alone you know maybe in the future you could say you know as you are able to you know spend 50,000 or 100,000 into a syndication deal like mine then you please please reach out and we'll be in touch see the thing is you got to keep your time is so important. So you want to spend time with the potential investors who have 50,000 or 100 or 200 or 500,000. You might say, Vinny, oh my gosh, that's too much. But you know, it's amazing. If you set up your mind that you want to work with few investors, but they will love to participate with you in a good deal. And I have found in my case, in the early years, 15 years back, people were saying, Vinny, can I put 25,000? They were trying to put 25 to just try me out, but they had more money than 25,000. So keep that in mind, because if you are able to set the stage a little higher in the starting, you'll be benefiting it very much later on. To be truthful, in my case, we have raised like, I have raised over 100, $222 million or so. And that's because I spent more time with rich investors in the early part of my life. And I knew that their peers and their friends and family will also be in that, you know, little bit richer uh, segment, let's say. And they could bring not only 100,000, but in the retirement, you know, they might have another 100 or 200, 250, thousand and that's what really served me so again you will like to talk to investors everybody's an investor please keep that in mind everybody's an investor because they want better returns much better than what they're able to get if they do stock market or uh, cds and or treasury notes or things like that you know, it's secure, but real estate is also very secure because it's a physical building that the syndication that you do or you are learning to do, the, you're going to bring them as your limited partners, but they're going to have their name, their LLC's name on the title of the property. 70% the investors will own and we syndicators will own 30% of that asset. So both the you know parties are owning that asset so the investors you want to really focus in are the ones who can give you 25 maybe if you want to start with 25 that's okay too in the starting but then you raise it up if you say to the investors you know 50 is my minimum then you will be surprised how many people will say yeah okay i'll invest 50. see now you got for 50 investor, 50,000, one investor. But if you go lower, you have to take care of two investors, right? I like to go for 100. I started to say 100 many years back and I've never gone back from there. That way I got almost four investors of 25 and I have to only deal with one investor only at 100. So I just trying to kind of share with you the psychology behind it. And actually, I've got so many great lectures that I've taped and, you know, videotaped and all. And hopefully you'll get a chance to see them also. But the big thing is abundance mindset. Everybody's got in money and they love to get 
money to work for them. And that's what syndication is. You are bringing their money into your deal as down payment, closing cost and all, and giving them huge returns in quarterly returns on their cash flow and equity gain without their any hassle of your investors to be on the loan or uh, you know losing sleep at night, not at all, nothing like that. So investors are really geared to invest their money for diversification, for making their money grow into syndication. I think you're gonna have a lot of fun, I can tell.